You were in a great win uh, last week at home against Roslyn Park. How happy were you with that? Yeah, really happy. Um, you know, we, we spoke the week before about you know, building a big score early doors and then not, you know, not putting Blackheath away after half time. And, you know, that was a big focus for our week. And, you know, we managed to get a good start. You know, Roslyn came back into the game, but, you know, we, we kept accelerating through the game and, and put up a big score. And, you know, that was what we wanted to do. And looking ahead to Saturday, it's our last game of the season against Loughborough. The game's already been called off twice, but you must be keen to get that one underway now. Yeah, uh, you know, it's, it's the end of the season, you know, we, we, we want to finish on a high at home, we want to finish third and, and, and a win on Saturday, you know, achieves all of that, so that's what we're looking for. And in a week when we said goodbye to Dan Mugford, we've also announced two new signings. The first, Davy McGregor, a uh, hooker who's back at the club for his third stint. What will Davy bring to the squad? Yeah, Davy's a, a good bloke, you know, he, he, he made first contact with us about coming back, you know, he, he loves the club, wants to be at the club and wants to be part of what we're doing, so you know, having someone with that attitude around you know, will, be a, will be a great help and, and obviously he provides you know, a bit of depth and a bit of competition in that, in that hooker slot. And we've also announced the signing of fly half Fraser Honey, who was Barry St Edmund's top scorer this season, he's an exciting prospect isn't he? Yeah he is, uh, yeah, he's someone I've known about for a couple of years now, yeah, we had a look at him last summer but it, it didn't quite come together so you know, really happy that we've, uh, we've managed to bring him on board, you know, it's, it's, it's a big step up for him, you know, he hasn't played at this level before but you know, the, the, the kid can play and he's got some good skill sets so I'm um, looking forward to having him on board. And another young man who's given a lot to the club this season is journalism student Tim March. Um, we've got a little present and I'm wondering if you'll present this to Tim. He's travelled sure. the Tim's length come and the breadth of the country for us. Yeah, thanks mate. Thank it's been thank a really good much. help. Right, so, yeah, I'll tell you that on, on behalf of the squad. Brilliant. On behalf <laughs> of Albion, Tim, thanks for everything you've done for us. Thank you very much, Lucy. <laughs>